As of this morning, we have 900 missing persons report reports. We have found 437 of them safe, just communication issues. Cell surface still having problems. People have been evacuated from multiple areas. They're just not connecting with their family. So 437 of the 900 are safe. 463 are still outstanding. We're doing targeted searches. So we have teams of people who are going out searching for a very specific person based on the missing person's case to a very specific place. That's how the majority of the recoveries have been made so far. Identification is going to be hard. So far in the recoveries, we have found bodies that were almost completely intact, and we have found bodies that were nothing more than ash and bones. One of the ways that we make IDs in those cases is through medical devices. So there, has been, there have been IDs in this case in a pile of ash and bones where there was a piece of metal left from somebody's surgery, like a hip replacement, with an ID number on it, and that helped us ID the person. So I'm sorry to have to tell you that, but that is what we're faced with in this fire as far as identifying people and recovering people. And that is why identification might take a long time in some of the cases. What I can tell you is we will do everything in our power to locate all of the missing people. And I promise you, that we will handle the remains with care and get them returned to their loved ones.